All right, so what are four ways you guys can start making money online? For those of you guys that don't know me, my name is Juan Valdez, and if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button, join the VFAM. So Pluto wanted to actually learn how to make money online, so I figured I'd put together a video, uh, not only for Pluto, but also for you guys, so you guys can also learn of four different opportunities I think uh, you guys can utilize to make money online. So uh, I have Pluto here, I'm gonna put him down right here next to me, so he's gonna be listening along. Uh, the first one to kinda get started, if I was just getting started to the internet world and I was just trying to make you know, my first $100 online or you know, just make my first dollar online, I'd probably start testing out affiliate marketing. For those of you guys that don't know what it is, it's basically where you promote other people's products and services. You end up getting a commission for every single time that somebody buys through your social media, through your their links that you're promoting these products. To actually start doing the actual business itself, like promoting and selling other people's products, it doesn't really cost you anything. I mean, you may, end up spending later on you know some money on advertising but again you're gonna be making a return on that so it doesn't really you know that capital is not just going to waste you're, you're you're making a return on whatever you invest in it but at first you can literally start promoting people's products for free just using you know your social media right now that you have if you start learning early on how you can promote other people's products and services you can use the same skill sets that you learn to promote their products and services for your products and services that you know you'll have later on you've already learned the skill sets of how you can promote other people's products and services and actually generate sales from doing it. And you can actually do the same thing with your products and services. So the next opportunity is, you guys probably may have already heard about it. It's been really huge within the last one or two years or so. And it's starting up a social media marketing agency where you help small and local business owners get more clients and more sales utilizing social media. So running ads for them, taking care of posting on their social media platforms and pretty much everything that involves their social media. So while you're learning social media marketing, you get to literally learn them all about social media not only for businesses but you also get to learn about social media and all the ins and outs for yourself as well because obviously you're gonna be the one handling the business and social media the third opportunity that I would actually consider getting involved with if I was just trying to get started making money online is Amazon FBA. Now, for those of you guys that don't know what Amazon FBA is, it's basically uh, fulfillment by Amazon, which is basically where you can become an Amazon seller and sell products utilizing Am Amazon's platform. They take care of all the fulfillment. You know, you take care of getting the product, shipping it to their warehouse, but you get to utilize their process of you know fulfilling the orders and all that stuff. Now, with Amazon FBA, there will be some type of investment, learning how the business works, either an online course or in-person in seminar and also there will be some startup costs to actually get started because you do have to pay for the inventory up front and it looks like the startup capital is like anywhere from like seven hundred dollars to like a thousand bucks as far as the skill sets go you do get to learn about how to really rank products really well because obviously the you know the way that you end up becoming like a top seller and really you know crushing the sales of your products is by you know learning how to rank these products really well getting good reviews and doing different things like that so you do get to the skill sets of learning how to rank products on amazon and you do get the skill sets of learning how to you know utilize reviews and all these different things to you know again rank your products really well on this platform all right so the last opportunity that i would choose to get started with if i was trying to make money online is e-commerce and drop shipping for those of you guys that don't know what e-commerce and drop shipping is it's basically where you're the middleman you basically find hot and trending products from different suppliers you know like from China, either through websites like AliExpress, DHgate. After you find these hot and trending products, you then make a website around these products. And then what you do from there is you drive traffic to these products. After you generate sales and people actually buy these products, you then take you know the revenue that you've already generated and then actually place the order from one of these suppliers and they take care of completely fulfilling the order. So you basically just middleman the whole process and you know there's no inventory, you don't have to touch any products, you don't have to fulfill any orders. The startup cost for e-commerce and drop shipping, I would say it ranges from anywhere from like 500 bucks all the way through a thousand bucks. And usually that startup cost is used for advertising. You can literally start up a Shopify store for free. I actually have a link in the description you guys can check out. You can literally get a two week free trial on just you know, on the platform itself, you can learn how it all works. So as far as the skill sets that you can learn within e-commerce and dropshipping, you can learn how to set up a website that actually converts, how to drive uh, paid traffic utilizing Facebook ads, Instagram ads, you know, Instagram influencers and all and a whole lot more. You're also gonna learn how to set up a backend system and utilizing email marketing. You're also gonna learn how to hire a team to help you automate your business. So for me, I'm a huge fan of obviously e-commerce and dropshipping because that's what I've seen the, the results and success in. What's pretty cool within all these opportunities is that if you learn about e-commerce and dropshipping, you can use the skill sets that you learn from, you know, let's say driving traffic to your store, you know, to do affiliate marketing, you can use the same 
same skill sets that it takes to drive traffic to your e-commerce store to then promote other people's products and services if you wanted to. Same thing with if you wanted to run a social media marketing agency, you can use the same skill sets and drive traffic to the, whatever clients you work with. You know, Obviously, I'm a huge fan of e-commerce and dropshipping, but I am also a fan of some of the other opportunities we just went over, so I figured I'd share them. You know, All these opportunities with you guys so you guys can consider which one you want to go after. For anyone that wants to specifically learn about e-commerce and dropshipping, I have put together what we call the P2P Dropshipping Accelerator. You can actually check the link in the description. Uh, it pretty much will teach you everything you need to to know from how to set up a Shopify store to how to launch your first Facebook ad campaign. So, you know, make sure you check it out. You'll also get to see a free training, you know, in the once you click the link. If you guys got any value from this video, make sure you leave me a thumbs up. Leave me some comments. Let me know which one of these opportunities you guys have tried out and which ones you guys like best. And of course, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button, join the VFAM, and I'll see you guys in the next video.